Prophet Sallallahu has explained the excellence of Surah Fatiha in many narrations. Like there is an incident explained in Firimbi that uh, Prophet Sallallahu asked one of his companions that would you want me to teach you a surah which is like no other surah which was revealed in Taurat or Injil or Zabur and not even in the Quran. And uh, he asked the companion what he had recited in his prayers. And the companion told that he had recited Surah Fatiha. And then Prophet said, by him in whose control is my soul, nothing like it has been revealed in the Torah, in Injil, in Daud, and um, in Zabur, and in Quran. And it is the seven frequently repeated verses in the mighty Quran, which I have been given. Similarly, Hazrat Abu Sa'ad, anhu, he reports in Mustad Ahmad that uh, a similar occasion that Prophet Sallallahu he said that he, he told me and he asked me that I will teach you a surah, which is the greatest surah in the Quran before you leave the masjid. And then he took hold of my hand. And uh, when before leaving the masjid, he asked me that uh, I asked him that you said that you would uh, teach me the greatest surah of the Quran. The Prophet Sallallahu said, yes. It is the surah with which the Quran starts. Alhamdulillah, Rabbil Alameen. And this is the surah in which, about which Allah has said in the Quran that these are the seven verses which are repeated. So this is the excellence that the Prophet said that this is the greatest surah of Quran. And then Hazrat ibn Abbas radiallahu ta'ala and who reports that the Prophet explains an occasion where uh, Hazrat uh, Jibra'il salam, was sitting with the Prophet salam, and he looked up at the sky and he said that I heard a creaking sound above and Hazrat Jibra'il told that I heard this creaking sound because a door in the heaven has opened today which was never opened previously and a group of angels has descended which never previously descended and he, that is Prophet Sallallahu will be given two lights, which no previous prophet was given. And these two lights were what? Surah Al-Fatiha and the last two concluding verses of Surah Al-Baqarah. And Prophet Sallallahu added here that you will never recite a word from these two without being given the blessings they contain. And in another hadith, Prophet Sallallahu also um, gave uh, the tidings and uh, informed all of us that whoever recites these two, that is Surah Fatiha and the last two verses of Surah Baqarah and then makes dua, his dua will be accepted. And then Hazrat Anas who reported in Nisai the Prophet said that should I not inform you of the most noble and the excellent part of Quran and then he recited Alhamdulillahi Rabbil Alameen. So this is all the excellence of Suratul Fatiha.